Hello everyone. We are at the last series in the Ashtangata, which is the Ashtangata, a combustion of Mars. Now, Mars's principal power is tenacity, willpower, the power to achieve and the power to move. It's highly kinetic, which is also why Mars uh, Mangal is associated to karma. Karma in, on its literal sense means actions, right? Moving moving forward, getting the job done, all right? Uh, and it is aptly associated to a general, you know, in a military, a general from Mars, uh, where, you know, a general always moves forward regardless of any uh, obstacles or impediments or whatever that comes his way, he will still move forward. He marches through all the problems. Okay. So again, Astaganta or combustion is when a graha comes to a close proximity to the sun. Of course, there are, there are mathematical uh, longitudinal references for that. Uh, doesn't mean if it's in the same sign, Rasi or zodiac sign, it, then its combustion occurs. No, it doesn't work that way. There are references easily available uh, on the internet. Just Google Astaganta um, longitudinal radius or uh, proximity of Akstangata, a combustion of the sun, and you will get the results. Okay, but anyways, the the point here is that the sun becomes angry, or what we call it as um, kopa. Kopa means rage or anger, and uh, it is it goes to a state of krura. Krura means cruel. So it becomes like a tyrant and re re burns down the principal power of the graha that comes close to it now rahu ketu doesn't fit here because they are they are not a physical graha uh, radiating graha it's just a mathematical point uh, and so the other seven grahas will have astangata so what happens when a graha like mars comes close to the sun and falls in the scheme of Astangata or combustion. What are the things that I've seen over the years? Uh, the first thing that I that I, I realize over the years is that when Astangata happens for Mars, and if you have it, then you may have this um, uh, uh, behavior of taking too much all at once, right? Say somebody gives you a, a task to do, you know, you will think out of out of proportion. You will try to get things done in a huge scale rather than trying to you know set small and sustainable and achieve achievable goal uh, you will look at a, a broader uh, perspective and usually when someone takes too much all at once it you know becomes disastrous so that's one thing i've seen other things is like never plan ahead very impulsive if you want to do something you just get it done not thinking about ramification, not thinking about what's going to happen, you know, just highly impulsive personality. Um, and um, some people will have this, you know, they gravitate towards temptations. It can be alcohol, sex, you know, lust, uh, pornography, watching, uh, extreme dieting. Some people, right, they go into this exercise, extreme exercise, whatever diet they have, ketogenic diet, whatever diet, they, they, they go into the extremes. Uh, if you're a student, then you tend to lie to your parents uh, or you cheat on your schoolwork. You know, your temptations will overrule you, right? Uh, and the last, certainly not the least, is a weakened willpower. Okay, this one is goes without saying. If you have a, uh, either a debilitated Mars or Mars in this Astangata, you'll have a weakened willpower. You're unable to um, get things done because your willpower is very, very low. All right so i hope this video is um, informational for you do stay tuned for other videos to come thank you for watching the entire astangatsa series namaste